When I first started writing my book on French military rifles, I had a bucket list goal of being a published author with collector grade publications. They were, and still are, the gold standard in small arms reference books. Unfortunately, Blake Stevens, the founder and editor of Collector Grade, passed away not that long ago, and his passing has left a substantial void in the collecting community and also in the publishing market. So with Collector Grade out of the question, I had to find a new publisher for my own book. And when I looked around at all the options that were available out there, none of them was really ideal. There were some good publishers, but guys who, you know, guys who were passionate about firearms but were in the process of retiring and not looking to take on new work. And there were also a number of large publishing companies that kind of just put out a whole lot of books. And I didn't want to be just, you know, one of a dozen different books that a company was going to publish this, this month or that month. I, I wanted a company that was really going to work with me to make my book the best that it possibly could be. So I brought up this problem with a couple of my collaborators and friends, Nick Jensen Jones and James Rupley. And the conclusion that we came to after some discussion was that there was only really one suitable option. We needed to create our own publishing company. That company is Headstamp Publishing, and we're here to take small arms books truly into the 21st century. And I should say, not just specifically small arms, but books on related military technologies as well. So artillery, ammunition, perhaps vehicles, you get the idea. Our goal is to create books that are as much works of art as they are works of scholarship, uh, to, to build a respected brand name of books that will truly stand the test of time as definitive references on their subject matter. So in order to do this, uh, my partners have brought some pretty impressive skills into this company. James, for example, is an outstanding photographer with a tremendous amount of experience in small arms and gun photography. In fact, you can see all of his work in the Vickers Guide series of coffee table books that are oversized and just gloriously photographed. Even those books don't really do justice uh, to his work. And then Nick. Nick founded Armament Research Services, and he has spent years developing a worldwide network of experts on a whole huge variety of different subject matters. And this gives us access to a tremendous amount of information and expertise that we can use to help authors do research, to do fact checking, uh, and much more. So why am I bringing this up today? Well, two reasons. First off, I'm really excited to be a part of Headstamp. I'm really excited to be in this partnership and able to help contribute to bringing excellent new reference material, reference books, to the community of small arms enthusiasts and historians and collectors. The internet has provided a true golden age of communications, and by allowing collectors and historians literally on other sides of the planet to communicate with each other, this, the internet has allowed us to share knowledge in a way that opens up the doors to creating reference books in a way that we never could before. And to be able to help facilitate that and take part in it is, to me, really exciting. My goal for years, for the whole time I've been running this video project, has been to perpetuate and uh, disseminate knowledge on these subjects. So it's really exciting to have this opportunity to help do that. Um, as potential readers, I think you'll be, you should be really excited to see some of the books that we've got coming. There are three that we already have in the pipeline right now. One is, of course, my book on French military rifles. We also have a book on uh, the history of British bullpup rifles being written by uh, the curator of the Royal Armouries in Leeds. That's going to be a fantastic piece of reference material. Uh, and then we also have a book on the history of the Kabul arsenal, and that's certainly a really cool story that deserves to be told. So. A uh, lot of cool material already in the pipeline that I think you guys will be excited to see. Now the second reason I'm bringing this up today is because I want authors or potential authors out there to know that Headstamp exists and that we're an, op an option for them. So some of you guys are legitimate experts, although you probably aren't willing to call yourselves experts, in your own specific fields of study. And you've probably considered writing a book at some point, but I think for a lot of people the challenge of trying to take on that project by yourself is just a bit overwhelming. It's, there's so much more to it than just writing a manuscript. You then have to provide photographs, you have to do editing, you have to do layout, you have to do marketing, you have to do actual sales and fulfillment, and that's not even touching on the physical printing of books. That's a lot of work, especially for a person whose expertise is in the history and the small arms. So, 
what Headstamp wants to offer is a really collaborative uh, process for helping you turn your manuscript into a really uh, a finished product that you can be really proud of. So we provide photography services, uh, we provide editing, we provide layout, we provide copy editing as well as fact checking. There are a whole bunch of different forms of editing that you uh, get to get used to once you get into this sort of work. Uh, we then do the actual physical printing, uh, and we do the orders and the fulfillment book shipping. So you're not stuck with five pallets of books in your garage for the next 10 years, which is the sort of thing that happens to a lot of self-published authors. So I should point out that uh, James and Nick both in this partnership have substantial real-world experience with actually physically printing books and taking that digital manuscript and turning it into a in to bring it to fruition as a, a physical product. So we have the experience covering the whole scope of the sort of the publication uh, business. So if you're an author out there, uh, we would love to hear from you if you think that this would be uh, a good way to help yourself put a good book into publication. Um, we're not going to print everything. We're not going to try and be a real high volume printer. Our goal is to take the best books that we can find, the ones that really deserve to be printed, uh, and spend the time to make them as good as they possibly can be. So I'm really excited to have my book finished up in the next couple of months and get it out there and into your hands, uh, both for its own sake and so that you can see the kind of quality that we're going to be creating with Headstamp. So uh, if you're interested either as an author or as a reader, make sure to check us out at headstamppublishing.com. We have an email list there that you can sign up for to, uh, to stay in touch with us uh, for new book releases, pre-orders, cool behind the scenes sorts of things. And of course, we have some contact information for you if you're an author and would be interested in uh, getting in touch with us about your own project. So uh, we'll have more to come in the future, but for now, thanks for watching.